Hey guys, it's Taste. Welcome to Phobia the Awakening. This is a Five Nights at Freddy's fan game featuring animatronics that are inspired by puppets made by a children's band known as the Wiggles. Now, I've never seen the Wiggles before, but if they're anything like what I'm seeing on the title screen right now, this is going to be frightening. Oh man, I got a bad feeling about this. Oh my god, what are you? Phone, left click, interact, okay. Hello, Mark, are you there? Okay. My name's Matthew, and I'm sure that you were informed that I was going to call you to, you know, help you out with your shift. If you weren't, then don't be too surprised. We aren't told much around here. Anyway, um, welcome to your new overnight job here at the warehouse. This warehouse holds many props, items, supplies, animatronics, and other stuff for a small closed-down restaurant chain known as Wiggle Pizza House, which honestly I think is a pretty absurd name, but whatever. Wiggle Pizza House opened in 1991 and closed down in 1998 due to the company not having enough money to keep it running for very much longer. And right now, they're looking for ways to reopen. Now, this job isn't exactly what you might expect, as you might not have been told. You see, out of all the animatronics we have stored here, only very few work good enough after all these years of them just sitting here and collecting dust. These ones in particular, and surprisingly, are the ones directly from the pizzeria. It may sound like a good thing that they're working, but I'd like to warn you that they aren't working in the way they should. Um, they say that the animatronics had technology that made them walk, but it was scrapped before the opening of the restaurant. So basically, the animatronics wander around the warehouse at night and have been reported to have a somewhat aggressive behavior. It's your job to make sure that these things don't wander outside or break anything or get inside your office. So if you feel like you're in danger, remember that you have a mask right under your desk. If anything wanders inside, just put the on, and they'll likely wander back out. It's worked before it seems to be a good solution. Uh, you've got some other tools, too. On the sides of the desk, you've got two buttons that will light up the hallways, so you can see down them, you know. You've got a camera monitor as well, which can be used to check around the area and make sure everything is how it should be. And I'm sure you've also noticed the small box with the lever on it. Please, only use that if the animatronic in front of you starts activating. There should be a note near it to help you out, and it's got important information on what to do and also what not to do. And I think I've got everything for tonight. Um, just watch the cameras, make sure nothing moves around, put the mask on if something happens to wander inside your office, and make sure the animatronic in front of you doesn't get too aggressive. I can assure you, as scary as this all sounds, it's likely a glitch in their systems and we're working to get it fixed every day. I'll try to keep you updated on things and I'll let you know if anything is changing. Your shift ends at 6 a.m. Stay aware and have a good night. That's it? Okay. Alright, so I figured some things out. The lights are here. I can't turn the lights off. They just go off by themselves. I get a mask if something comes. Something's gonna come down the halls to the right and the left. And then this ugly sucker is going to move or become active or something, and I have to shock him. Now, what's this note say? Warning, do not pull the lever unless the animatronic is acting aggressive. Pulling the lever will shock and momentarily deactivate the animatronic, but it will also add power to the animatronic. Please use this as sparingly as possible to prevent damage to the animatronic and possibly yourself. Thank you. Okay, so... Can I try it once? I'd like to see what, what it does. No! Oh! Yup, it shocks it. Okay, I have to watch out for that guy. And then things are gonna come left and right. And I have to put my mask on, I'm thinking, for that. This is kinda cool, you can look around the whole room. You can look up, down, sideways. Now there's missing kids on the bulletin board. What? There's a, huh? oh, oh crap. Oh, it looks like me. He's talking. Do I have to put my mask on? Holy, holy crap! Can you use the light. It looks like me! Hey guys, it's Taste Gaming. Oh! He's not going away. He has to get closer. 
He probably has to come in the room. Okay. Do you look the same? Oh, I'm, I'm freaking out. This is really, really cool, but it's freak. Ah! Ah! Holy jumpins. I'm not sure when to put the mask on. I think he has to come in my room. He's not. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, okay. It does look like me. Hey, guys. It's me, Dace. I'm coming to kill you. Okay. Hey, let's put the mask on. I'm watching. Look at that thing. It's freaky. Hey. Okay. Just keep watching him. This mask has to work. Can I get this mask on the whole time? Hey, I don't think you're moving. Oh. Okay, wait. Just wait. There, he's moving. Oh! Oh! Is he gone? Is he gone? He's gone. He's gone. Okay. He does. He has to come in the room first. Okay. Oh. Oh, now there's... Look at that. The glowing eyes. Who's that? That's a purple guy. I'm not sure what their names are, <laughs> but the guy on the right looks like me. Oh. He's talking smack. Okay. Does that guy look the same? This one's going to freak me. It's going to freak me out. Okay, does this guy act like the, the one on my right? He has to get close to me? Okay, let's check around. Okay, the purple guy was one of these three. He left. What? That's a guy with a hat. Okay. Huh! Ah! Okay, I'm taking a chance for not putting the mask on, but I think he has to come in the room. Look at that mouth! Oh man, this can't be a children's show! The kids would have nightmares! Okay, just, just, just keep watching. Huh? Huh? Okay, he stops. He stops. Does that puppet look the same? Oh my god, okay. If he comes in the room... Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, if he comes in the room... You know what? Put it on now. Put it on. Put it on. Put it on. I think his next move is to come in. He's still there! He's still there. Ah! I see him. I see him. Oh, he hasn't moved. Oh, what's with the music? What's with the music? That thing hasn't moved. Oh, the music's getting loud. Maybe I have to do something different for him. I'm watching. Oh, what? What happened? Is that it? I made it through the night, there we go! We made it through night number one! So the first night introduced us to two of the puppets. They seem to attack from either side. We just have to use the mask when they try to enter the room. Now we're moving on to night number two, and it looks like a pirate is active on this night. Okay, here we are. Maybe this sucker comes to life as well on night number two. Okay, let's listen to the phone call. Hey, how was last night? It was creepy. I'm pretty sure it went well. No. So it's important for me to tell you right now that today the animatronic known as Captain Feather Sword has been acting up. He's on camera six and he needs constant supervision. He seems to move when not being watched, even on cameras for some reason. Keep an eye on him because he might move out of the room if you don't. And if he does, then I'd recommend looking for him on the cameras. He can go anywhere, and maybe watching him for a bit from there might do something. Okay. It might reset his path and send him back to where he first was, but uh, we've never really seen what happens. So it's best to just not let him get out of his room, okay? Okay. I'd also like to point out that the lights inside your hallways are very bright, and some animatronics seem to be sometimes sensitive to bright lights, uh -oh. but not always. I don't know how well this works, oh, but maybe no. try it out if you have to. It could have a small chance to stall him for a bit. Uh, well, maybe that might not be a great idea. Stalling. It would just keep them in the hallways, and that might not be the smartest thing to do. Oh. It's probably best to let them wander out by using the mask gun to keep them watching you in the halls. Oh, anyway, okay. I'm sure you've got everything under control. Keep an eye on Captain Feather Sword. Use the mask if you need to, and also keep an eye on the animatronic in front of you, and make sure he doesn't activate. 
As for everything else, all seems to be going somewhat okay despite what's been going on with Captain Feather Sword. Good night, Mark. Okay, so Captain Feather Sword we have to stare at. And I think the left side, the purple one, I was shining the light on it in night number one, and it wasn't attacking. Because that's the one that gets stalled by the light. That could be good or bad depending on what's attacking me in later nights. So if I want the left one to attack me, don't shine the light. The right one that looks like me, the light doesn't affect it. It's going to move no matter what. Now, I also got to keep an eye on this elf looking thing. That's creepy. So keep an eye on Captain Featherstone. Oh boy. Don't shine the light on the left one. If you want it to attack, and the right one's going to attack no matter what you do. Is that it? Okay, the purple one's gone. Where's the purple one? Oh boy. Okay, there it is there. Okay, I don't have to worry about those. I gotta worry about this one if it moves. And that one. Did it move? Ah! Okay, that's what it looks like me. Right? For not. There it is. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. Did that move? That moved, didn't it? Shock it. Did that move? It did. It was looking right at me. Now it's looking down. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, this is horrifying. Huh. Okay. That thing comes in my room. That thing moved. Okay, everything is moving. There's four. There's four on this night. Is anybody there? Yes, I'm here. Okay. Be ready. Be ready for that thing. Okay, that's the third time it moved. Holy crap, it's close. Okay, you're looking down. We're good. Nothing to the left. Keep an eye. It comes in my room. Get the mask. Get the mask. When do you move? When do you move? Keep watching. Keep watching. You're looking down. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Keep staring. Keep staring. <gasps> Okay, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. Oh no, now the left one. Do I stall that if the light turns on? I'm not sure, I gotta keep staring at the pirate. And you! Okay, I'm watching you as well. Big smile. <gasps> okay, it's moving. It's moving. Okay, if I turn the light on, you can stall? I'm not sure. <sighs> what time is it? It's three o'clock. Why can't I grab that hammer? Tom the living crap! Oh, he's close. Oh my god! This is freaking me out! Okay. Get ready. If I hear any movement to the left, I'm grabbing the mask. A mask! Yup, yup, yup! The light! I think the light delays him just before he comes in the room. If I use the light, I think it's gonna delay him. Did you move? Did you move? Oh, you're not moving. Oh my god, this is freaking me out. This really is. This is scary. Did you move? I can't tell if it moved. It's looking down. Oh boy. Dude, don't pull the lever. Okay, I'm not gonna pull the lever. I gotta keep an eye on this thing. I can't tell if it moved. Holy chumpins. What's that? What's that? I can't tell. Uh oh, the lights are flickering. Turn around. Four o'clock. Four o'clock. Okay. Is it every time the light flickers, it means another hour has gone by? Not sure. I gotta figure out if this thing has moved a little bit. Oh. The lights flickered. What time is it? Nope. Never mind. Stupid light. Okay, keep an eye on the pirate. Keep an eye on you. Okay, it's looking straight at me. I think his head is... Let's do it. His head tilts. Yes, his head is tilted when it's normal. Okay. So his head straightens up when he moves a little bit. Okay. <gasps> Here I come again. Oh my god. Okay, keep an eye on that. Keep an eye on you. Oh, what was that? What was that? I heard something. You move three or four times. You're getting closer. Yup. This is actually pretty cool. Okay. Oh my god.
God, he has one droopy eye. I'm seriously going to have nightmares about this game. These things slowly trying to get me. Head tilted. Captain there. Oh, 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 oh. Keep an eye. Keep an eye. Don't, no, 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 no. <sighs> He's talking smack. We're fine. Okay, you gotta move one more time. Then you're coming in the room. Are you over here? You're not. Okay, keep an eye on you. You're going to move again. Oh man, he's close. Okay, next movement. Your head is straight. Get you. That's right. Tilt your head. Crap, crap, crap. Okay, he's talking smack. He's talking smack. He's talking smack. Okay. Oh, now the other guy's coming. Oh, put it on. Put it on. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Okay. Off, 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 off. Okay. Now you're over here, right? You're here. Yep. There's the purple one. I think the light delays him just before he comes in the office. If I want to keep him out of my office... When he gets right before he comes in, I think you shine the light. That's going to delay him. We might need to do that in later nights when everything's attacking me. We'll see. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Oh, oh no. What time is it? Okay, five o'clock. We're getting close. No, oh, your head's straight. Your head's straight. Shock you. Shock you. There you go. Keep an eye. Keep an eye. No. Crap. We do it! We did it! Woo! We got through night number two! Alright everyone, that was the first two nights of Phobia the Awakening. I know this is a Five Nights at Freddy's fan game, but I'm really enjoying the gameplay and the atmosphere is super creepy. I want to thank you for spending some time with me. I hope you enjoyed these first two nights. I'll be back real soon to continue playing this game. Love you guys. Love you Molly. See you all next time.